everybody and welcome back to another fun and exciting episode of Twilight Game where we are going to play Arch Hero. In this game, each level we have to kill the enemies and raise our level. As we raise our level, we will raise our skills. As you can see at the beginning, the levels are fairly easy. As we go on, there will be more monsters. Now each monster has something special about them, whether they are just moving in a different direction, whether they only shoot in one direction, it's all dependent on the monster. So with this here, this means that I have leveled up as an adventurer, and I get to choose which special ability I want to have. Whether I want it to bounce off walls, whether I want to have a shield around me, or whether I want to have lightning around me. I just chose shield for this time. Now with the characters shooting, they usually shoot at the closest one to them. But of course you know that that does not mean that we're going to hit the target every time. So with these monsters here, they shoot three directions. The first one will always be the middle one coming towards you. So just make sure you move off to the side, but not too far to where the attack will hit you. The found angel is always something very good. It'll always give you an option of two good things. That was the health boost or just raising of my health if I had too many hits before. Um, the next one would be the found devil. That one always makes you sacrifice something in order to get something in return, so be careful of that one. So as you can see, there's three new abilities again, and I will choose smart arrow. Yeah, I think I'll go with smart arrow on this one. Attacking people really doesn't matter unless you hit them, so that's why I chose Smart Arrow. So these monsters are actually interesting. They shoot in four directions, always forward and sideways. They don't turn, but they do hop. So they will hop towards you, making them sideways, or they will hop to the side, making it more likely to hit you forward. So just keep an eye out on that one. Now I'm just going to skip a few levels and uh, take you up ahead. Here are three new abilities. And I think I usually go with Piercing Shot or Poison Touch. So this time I'm going to choose the Attack Speed Boost. This will definitely help. Let me bring you into a boss battle. So this is what a boss battle is like. It's a little harder as they attack in multiple directions all the time. This is where your dodge skills or my shield will definitely come into effect. As you can see my health is already down pretty far and I was doing pretty good on regular battles. I think I just need a little bit more practice on this one. Oh my gosh, I don't know if I'm going to make it. Oh, thank goodness. Alright, this is the lucky wheel. Let's see what we get. Coin! Always can use some coins. They help with major upgrades later that will go into playing these levels again. But they won't be just temporary ones like the abilities that I have now. They will go towards your permanent abilities. As you can see, I'm now at level 5. I have three new abilities to choose from. And this time, I'm going to choose Death Bomb. Alright, so we found another angel. So let's see. I will... Strong Heart, I think. Now I'm going to skip through a lot of these battles here, just because 
I find it a little repetitive at some point, but it is definitely something to get drawn into. Oh gosh, I think I'm gonna die here. Guess not. Seems to be my lucky day. You know the saying about counting your chickens before they hatch? I think, yeah. That just happened to me here. No luck. No revive. Let's go back to the main screen. And we can finally see what all the other stuff is about. This is the Verdant Prairie. This is where I would go to enter the level. Now for chapter one, I have to get up to 20 chapters to get to chapter two. This is actually a little difficult for me. This is our talent page where we would press to upgrade. It will click on a random one and it'll upgrade that skill for us. These talents are stick with us forever. Not just like the skills we get when we're in the game for um, the first stage to the X stage I, till I die. I do have a couple gold, so I'm just gonna raise some of this talents up so that I can be stronger, you know? Maybe I'll finally get to that stage 20. This is the shop where you can spend real money to get gems, or you could use gems to get money. In-game money, though, not real stuff. I wish, right? So as you can see here, it costs five energy to play. Let's go. Again, you always get to start off by picking one ability first. I definitely like this one. Now, since we are in the beginning stages and you've seen this before, let's jump ahead to something more interesting. And what could be more interesting than my inevitable demise? Here we go. From two to seven. There's so many monsters, they're all shooting in different directions, and here we go. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, no, no, oh yeah. That's what I thought. I didn't think I was going to last on that one either. I'm not going to waste my time spending gems on reviving, because I'm just still in the beginning stage of play. So what I need is to upgrade my abilities again, so my talents. Let's see what I get. Hopefully something good, 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 good. Please, please, please. Nah. My power. Okay, at least I'm a little stronger. I'm flexing my muscles, but you can't see. It's okay. I don't really have any muscles anyway, so you wouldn't have been able to see them. Alright, I'm just going to move on forward through this again. All right, let's get past this boss and see, ah, uh, the devil. See, he only gives me one option and it costs my HP. And it's not just the health, it actually takes the bar itself down. This guy is so evil. I did it anyways. Oh my god. Why does he have to make things harder for me? All right, let's keep going. See the arrow guys, they shoot and they always show the line of sight of where they're going to shoot. So just make sure you dodge at the last minute so that they don't keep having their arrow line of sight on you. And the skeleton guys, they'll, they'll shrink a little when you attack them. So you just have to keep attacking them until they disappear completely. But hey, I'm at uh, 14 already, which is exciting. And with not very much health either. Ooh, please do something good. I don't need health, I'll take attack. Oh wow, the sound on this just went way up. 
Also, at the end of every level, it, all the coins and stuff just automatically go to you. All those things on the floor, you can't touch them. You don't want to get chopped up. Even after all the bad guys are gone. Gotta make sure you go into a spot where all the arrows will be easy to dodge after they set their sights on you. Oh my gosh, am I gonna make this one? I did! <laughs> oh, I need more HP. <laughs> There are too many of these things. Uh, go. Ha! If I go down one side, I don't have to worry about two. A boss fight? I'm not ready for this. As you can see, these bosses are just bouncing off the walls, so just make sure you're not going to be in their line of bounce. And you'll be okay. So I think it's possible that I think I got this. Another devil? This is- this is too cruel. I really want this. Uh... I did it. Oh my gosh, I have like, no HP. Look at my bar, it's so teeny tiny. But I got like, my arrows look like flamethrowers coming out of there. Things definitely get way more interesting when you get in higher levels. This is awesome. I'm glad I was able to bring you guys this far. Oh, some new abilities. Uh, holy touch. Oh my gosh, this sound is just like so loud. So loud. Let me just run right through here. Oh, an angel, thank God, please. I don't need regular health, I'll just take attack. I want my health bar to go up. <laughs> Who would have thought when your health bar is so low that you'll finally do something good? By you, I mean me, at this point. I'm sure you guys would have been awesome and gotten this far way before I would have. I actually died a few times and I cut that part out. So, I got some abilities. And talents. I got some talents that, uh, that might not have been there before. <laughs> Alright, let's get past here. 27. I can't believe I'm at 27. Oh my god! No! It's like gonna be like three hits and I'm dead. So strong though. Look at this. Maybe if I keep raising my attack boost, but... Poison touch, that's probably the best option. There we go. Now I have the arrows hit them once, so they'll either die or the poison touch. Yeah. Oh, okay. Now, I don't think I said this before because I was in a different, uh... I skipped a, a few battles, but I did get a ability that when I attack, it does raise my health a little bit when I kill that monster, so... See? Look at that! My health! That's the only thing that's been saving me right now. I think it was like a vampire... something. Always need more gold. Need that gold to raise your talent. Oh my gosh! The battle's already started! Ah! ah, that one. That one. That's what I got. That's the only thing that's saving me right now. I'm 
pretty much starting every battle out fresh. Because I sucked all their blood, blah blah blah. We don't say blah blah blah. I don't know what to talk about. Oh my god, this is so stressful! In a good way! <laughs> I don't know how much longer I'm gonna last. Uh, the stupid fence is in my way. Okay. I almost got this. Oh my gosh, how many arrows were just on me? I just died. Yeah, okay. Did you see all those arrows at me? And then I was like, pfft, dead. Because they all hit me at once. But look, 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 see? Look at stage I got too. I'm excited. All right, time for a new talent. What do I get? What do I get? Recover. Nice. That is always something I need. What else can I get? Let's see. Uh, inspire. Well, that's not bad. So as you can see here, I can open the chest. Ooh, a wolf ring. And I can put on armor now. This is what I've got so far. Now I look like a badass assassin, huh? Just like my other game that I played Assassin's Creed. That was a fun one. That's the one where half my audio is great quality and half my audio is crap quality because I had gotten my new mic and I really wanted to try it out. These are my abilities at the moment. Or talents, I guess I would say. Nice. Always, I, I actually enjoy the power. By watching a small video, you can get this for free. So, that's what I'm gonna do. Alright, so if you go into here, you can see all the different little stages that there are. And as you can see, I'm pretty much right at the beginning. It's not pretty much, I am at the beginning. I am just that bad. I know you guys can do better than me. Play the game. Now, as I was saying before, this is my equipment. Now if I put different equipment on, it'll actually make my hero look different and give me different stats. So keep an eye on what you're looking for because uh, I know some people like to play different things and it'll make them look different. And I kind of like being a badass assassin so this is what I'm going to stick with. This is my ring. I'm so happy for it. It looks really, really cool. And this is my bow. I like the bow. You will get other weapons in the future, but uh, I don't know. I like the bow. Anyways, guys, um, I think I'm going to cut the video off here. Thank you so much for watching all my videos so far. You guys have been such an amazing audience. This is Twying Game. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and the notification bell down below. Bing, bing. And this is why. Out. This is why. Um, uh, wow. Welcome back to another fun and exciting. Uh, oh, come on. Blah, 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 Because this isn't easy enough. Thanks guys. I hope you enjoyed the blooper.